everyone, welcome back to my channel. So we're gonna be doing a tutorial today. Um, it is the eye look I created using the Viseart Trist palette. Um, I absolutely love this palette. This is everything I think of when I think of springtime, just the pinks and the light colors. Um, and I really, really enjoy this palette. So I'm going to share with you today um, the purple eye look I created using this. So let's just go ahead and jump right into it. The only thing that I have done so far is I have done my eyebrows. Um, so as far as primers go, um, you know, I always go with my Urban Decay primer potion. This is a longtime favorite. It is amazing. And then also lately I have been loving the Laura Mercier um, primer. I have a couple other ones, but these are just kind of my go-to's. But I think I'm going to use this because I'm trying to use this one up. Um, where's my mirror? <laughs> when we got started, I've already lost my mirror. What the heck? All right. my eye primer on I'm just gonna go ahead in with the wet n wild creme brulee and this is just to kind of set it in place and I'm just gonna use the fluffy brush all right so we're just gonna start off we're gonna use the lightest shade which is in the top corner right here and we're gonna put that all in our crease with this pinky shade right here. The name of it is <laughs> Liaison. And we're gonna put that just a little bit below where we brought up the, the first color. Um, I don't know if I told you guys before, but I just went in with a fluffy brush. Um, this one is actually from Wet n Wild. Um, next, I'm going to go in with a Sigma E45. Um, and we are going to go in with this color right here. Um, let's see. Elicit is the name, I believe. So it would be the darkest shade in the pan. And we're going to put that on our outer corner and work that into the crease. switch it up. Let's see. Let's go in with my Morphe 321. This should be better. fluffy brush and take some more of the pink sorry take some more of this pink shade and we're going to blend that out all right so now I'm just going to take a flat shader brush this is a Morphe M167 and we're going to take this purple color right here we're going to put that rapture and we're going to put that um, on the lid So that is a dry brush. I do want to make this a little bit more intense. So I'm just going to add a little uh, Max Fix Plus.
So now that we have that all blended, I'm just going to take a Wet n Wild liner brush. This is one of my favorite brushes to do my lower lash line with. Um, and we're going to go back in with that pink shade right here. We're going to put that along the lower lash line. Now I'm going to take, what was this color? Um, Elicit, this one, dark one right here. We're going to go back along the lower lash line as well. to pop on my eyeliner and mascara and I will be right back okay so I am back I am so glad I did that off-camera because I had a huge mishap with my mascara and it took me forever to fix it um, I don't know if you can tell but yeah so um, I went ahead and I applied my blush I used my Tarte Exposed this is such a beautiful color I went ahead and applied my highlighter I don't know if you can tell but I love this highlighter. This is the Dandelion Twinkle Highlighter from Benefit. Um, so the only thing left to do is our lipstick, and this is going to be from Bare Minerals. I got this in a, um, a Sephora Favorites, and I freaking love this lipstick. I am going to have to purchase a full size of this because this is not going to last me. Um, this is a beautiful, beautiful lipstick, and I am looking for my mirror because... <laughs> I lose it like every two seconds. So, uh, once again, that's in Bare Minerals and the color Boss. Oh, this color is so freaking pretty. I can't even get over it. Yes. Ooh. All right, guys. So this is the finished look. I hope you enjoy the way that this look turned out. I know I certainly do. Um, it's just a simple eye look, and I absolutely love it. So if you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. You can also follow me on Instagram. I will have that link down below as well, and I will see you guys on my next video. Bye.